What's up guys, Hicking here, bringing you some news regarding Resident Evil 4 Remake. This is going to be a quick thing, I'm just going to go through it very fast. So yeah, apparently a few days ago there was a concept art leak per, you know, showing Albert Wesker in the game, or what his model would look like. Apparently this was leaked by DC Darkless himself, he's the voice actor for Albert Wesker in Resident Evil 5, Umbrella Chronicles, Dark Side Chronicles, and I believe the Resident Evil Zero Remaster. I could be wrong about that. I think when I checked it did say that. But yeah, apparently he uh he, he's back. He's he's doing he's doing Wesker again for, for the Resident Evil 4 remake. He had some concept art that he showed to a friend that leaked that friend leaked it. And now it's all over the internet. And we have no idea what's gonna happen with that. We don't know if he's gonna get fired for this, uh, if he's breaking NDA or maybe it's okay for him to leap to post this. I don't know. I mean, let's be honest, guys. We all know a Resident Evil 4 remake was happening. This isn't like out of nowhere. Do you know what I mean? It's just a case of when the game's going to come out. Uh, uh, looking at this picture here, of course, uh, I like the look. I like it. It's a very slick, modern look for the character. Um, he's got a burnt. Um, what is this? Is this his. Uh, let's see. Mm, if I stand on this side. So the left arm, the left arm is burnt heavenly. This could be uh, related to his fight with Alexia in Cold Veronica, perhaps, where he got burnt potentially. It doesn't look like he's got, I think he does have like a few scars. He's got like a scar going down here, maybe. Maybe the side of the face, we can't see properly. Maybe it's a bit burnt. But uh, it, it does feel like this is a Wesker that has gone through the events of Cold Veronica. So it's a bit it's a bit upsetting we're not getting that as a remake and we're getting we're jumping straight into four instead. But yeah, I like what I'm seeing here. This looks like an awesome kind of outfit to cosplay as, you know, if if this is what he looks like in the final game. Um, it looks good. Uh, it's just a question of is DC Douglas officially going to come back now that this has leaked? Um, there's also the question of what Wesker's role in this game apparently is because apparently DC Darkness also revealed that this is for the Ada Separate Ways campaign. So that confirms that that campaign is in the remake as well. Uh, one of my ideas for Resident Evil 4 was to have Wesker physically appear in the game, maybe even have him as a boss uh, encountering Leon and fighting him. I'm really hoping that the overall story is vastly different. It would be very interesting if we could get Wesker involved in the events of RE. Ori 4 in a physical way and him into actually interacting face to face with Ada and him maybe meeting with Leon and kicking his ass and vice versa because uh, it's kind of weird that uh, uh, the, the secondary main hero of the series has never encountered uh, what would be considered sort of like the main baddie of the, of the franchise but yeah uh, I'm liking where this is so far going I'm hoping we get more news on this obviously Outrage is supposed to be the next Ori game coming out and yet so far nothing on that which is very very strange and weird that we haven't gotten anything or heard anything about that maybe at the game uh awards uh, this this month is it this month are we yeah we are on the first of december now so yeah this month maybe we'll get something then but yeah for now we got this pick also uh the person who leaked this or, or the person who leaked the leak uh, has been saying some very, I don't want to go too far into it, but they've been saying some very disturbing things regarding DC Darkless. And from doing my own research and reading up on it, it seems to be a lot of bollocks. Um, the evidence that the person provides, honestly, from what I'm seeing, is of two consenting adults sexting each other. That's what it is. There doesn't seem to be any malicious intent. Uh, you know, as far as I'm concerned, if the guy is, uh, you know, is cheating on his wife or girlfriend, whatever, that's his business. It's not mine. That's not something to go, oh my god, he's a rapist or a pedophile. Like, I don't know, the way the way that, that the person makes it sound like is, is that's what that's what's going on. But I've read DC Douglas's blog as well. And this is also the same person that's accused several other people who have been found uh, innocent as well, uh, including Quentin Flynn, uh, who at the time we all thought was, was, you know, doing some shady shit, but no, creepy shit, or at least shady shit in terms of, oh yeah, he's an asshole, but uh, not enough to go, oh yeah, this guy should get cancelled, no, uh, nothing like that, nothing serious or fucked up like that is going on, so, yeah, um, I'm I'm gonna stick with this guy's story, like, I'm gonna believe what this, what, what you know, what DC is saying, and what the others are saying, uh, 
what's the what's the word? What's that saying? Uh, proven until innocent or proven until guilty. So yeah, uh, I wouldn't I wouldn't put too much faith on on what this uh, p a person is saying online on Twitter because clearly they're they're a freaking stalker and and not all there in the head. Uh, so yeah, uh, that's that. Hopefully it's not enough to get him. And if, if, if it is true, which I, I doubt it, I doubt it. Again, if you read up on this stuff, it doesn't line up with what we know and heard and what we read like. So yeah, um, yeah, not really bothered by that. Like, all I'm saying is do your research, guys. Do your research and have a different viewpoint on things. Don't just go right in believing it. Uh, it's it's like the whole situation with Johnny Depp and Amber Heard or Mick Mc, Mc, McYon or... Uh, like it's just it's just people it's honestly this cancel culture man in this day and age is, is ridiculous that's what it is it's just stupid um but yeah resident evil 4 remake pretty much confirmed at this point um uh, looking forward to it hopefully it's gonna be good and i'm probably gonna start doing some videos on uh, the games on resident evil games that will that should get a remake or how they should be remade yeah, guys, remember to like and subscribe, and I shall see you when I shall see you. Take care, and bye.